Okay, it is Super Bowl Sunday in February, Logan County, Historic Guthrie, Oklahoma, and it is cold. <laughs> so in the greenhouses right now, we are still warm as of right now. Later this evening, we'll have to come out and flip some heat on. I went ahead and had to buy another one of these because I got these precious seedlings and... You know, when they drop down, when it drops down, sorry, I'm not good at multitasking. And it's it was too cold to do the tripod. And look, I'm in so many layers, I can't even hardly walk, let alone bend down and try to do something. So, here we go. I'm going to hook this up. I just got this piece yesterday. They brought this... To today, this Mr. Heater little buddy, um, you know, we're, we have the, that greenhouse, the geothermal greenhouse ordered. It's not here yet. The temps are going to be down, what is it, tonight? It changes, because the Oklahoma weather changes so much that you just never know. But anyway, back to what I was getting at. I could not find any of these in the store. I've been trying for a couple weeks, trying to prepare. Finally just decided I do like most things and just go ahead and order on Amazon because I can't find half of what I need anymore in the stores. So I'm going to go ahead and flip this on just to test it and then flip it back off. If I can even get this open. So I got that propane turned on. I think I'm going to put this over here since this cord, this is all pretty new, so the cord's not really bending very good. I'll set that over there. I kind of wanted to keep it out of the doorway. I'm going to make sure this one works. I have one, another one of these in the other greenhouse, and they're, they're really amazing. There's the pilot light. You can see that. Okay. Oh. That's crazy. It went out. I smell gas. Not good. <laughs> I don't have time to deal with any technical issues. There we go. There it goes. You can see that it's lit. And you can see it going. So this is a really good thing. Yes. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and turn it back off. Because as of right now, it's a little above. Oh, it's almost 49 in here. I did have a little electric heater plugged in. But I didn't feel like that was going to cut it. And I need that little electric heater somewhere else. So. For. Whew. Yuck, I'm not a weather, cold weather person. It's kind of misting, the wind is kind of blowing. And I too, I look like a really fat chick right now. I have a lot of layers on. Okay, so this has been off since this morning. Had it on last night because it dropped down in the teens. Let's see, where did I put that? All right. Well, see, it's still staying right around 45 I guess is kind of what I see here I broke the little thing so when I go to Dollar Tree I'm going to pick up a couple more of these because they are really handy they're plastic and if it breaks you're only out a dollar I've tried the expensive ones and I'll be honest they don't last these have held up really good and they're just a dollar at Dollar Tree so see some of the seedlings now those are roughwoods. Those are what I'm growing for the roughwood company so that they can have seeds. And there's some zinnias. Of course, you know, I, rosemary, I went ahead and put as many of these as I could get in here. The wind blows and so it's knocked down some of my shade cloth. In Oklahoma, you have to have shade cloth. 
and that's not looking too good, but it's still producing. There are tons of ladybugs in here. So this is the first greenhouse we built. So we made mistakes on it, but it, at least it works. Oh my goodness, the citrus is blooming and it smells amazing in here. I went ahead and gave it a really, really good thorough watering last night. So it's still pretty moist in here. I do not water every day. So this will be ready to turn on later. As of right now, it's warm enough in here. Just wanted to share that with you guys. See, lemons. All right, you guys take care. Wendy at Hardneck Farms.